I think following your curiosity, it's such a superpower. And I, I always thought that everyone had curiosity, but I've yeah. kind of learned over the years that a lot of people don't know what that feels like. And I think when I worked in corporate all those years ago, I used to implement accounts payable into corporates and I had lost it. I didn't have any ideas. I mm. never would have thought I could have written fiction. Yeah. And I loved action movies. And when I wanted to write, I, I wrote that. But back then, I just did not understand how to tap into what I was interested in and then turn that into a story. But that's kind of the the superpower, right, is, yeah. is tapping into it's like a sensation. And there might be people listening who don't understand what that feels like. They might think, oh, I would love to write fiction, but I don't know how. And I think that's the first step. It's sort of, when do I turn my head to look at something? Or when yeah. do I click on something? Or when do I see an image that makes me interested or a news item? And that's the thing that's you, that's that's different. We put our fascinations into our writing. And I think people shouldn't be scared to do that. And again, like coming back to how the world has changed, we'd all like to have the blockbuster. We'd like to have that breakout massive success. But the reality is being a writer for as long as we are and still being a writer is we have a niche and yeah. we just have to please the readers in our niche.